self-imposed deadline for a deal on the Islamic Republic's nuclear program. Well, despite that failure, both sides said the considerable progress that he made at those talks they've given themselves now until July to reach an agreement. Well, of course, Van team was given special access to Tehran's nuclear research reactor. They then showed what they filmed to a French nuclear expert. Here's their exclusive report. Its cooling tower rises above the compound homes of the Iranian Atomic Energy Agency. Whilst Van Kant was granted special access to the Tehran research reactor, the country's first ever built nuclear facility. Tehran research uh, reactor is uh, constructed and designed in uh, 1960s in order to perform uh, for, uh, fundamental nuclear research. The U.S. supplied the reactor, but after revolutionary Iran cut ties with the West, the country went in search of new partners. In the late 80s, the reactor was converted to operate with low-enriched uranium, and Argentina provided the fuel. Just enough, though, for 10 to 20 years. At the moment, we exhausted from uh, the uh, abroad fuel elements, and we have tried, of course, the government has tried to produce the, the domestic fuel elements in the country. According to our guide, a third of the fuel burned here is made domestically, and authorities have planned to produce more to meet growing needs of the Russian-built Boucher power plant and expand the country's nuclear capacities. Add two more new uh, type of, uh, this type of uh, uh, power plants, and there is going to be more again after these three 